I have 60. Let's get to the traffic center. Hey, Jamie. Yes. Uh, here's USA Today. Mm -hmm. Remember we were talking about the, the fact that you can take New York One on the road now with the Time Warner cable app? I, I was. Look, look at the, the front page of the, the business section of USA Today. There's Diane King Hall. Hey, look at that. And I can report, actually, my boyfriend is in Florida right now, and he was watching earlier this morning. He said the quality is fantastic. I, I don't know why. It's, it's, like it's a big thrill when you're on television to be in the newspaper. I'm not sure why that is. Well, of course it's a big deal. <laughs> newspapers are a big deal. You're, you're the king of the uh, newspapers true. in this town. Uh, that's true. Yeah. <laughs> well, we'll get to your morning commute now from wherever you're watching. We're happy that you're joining us. Let's get a check of the rails. Everything's on a close schedule. Subways and buses are doing fine. Regional rail lines are in good shape. He's funny sometimes. 8.07 in the morning, and we begin with a problem on the Belt Parkway eastbound at Springfield Boulevard. Two lanes are blocked with an accident, and now we've got some big-time delays to go right along with it. From JFK Airport heading towards Long Island, trying to get to the Cross Island, you're going to be sitting a little bit of extra heavy traffic than what you're used to.